Um, you hit the nail right on the head. I, I was so naive when I was watching your channel and I started doing research on wanting to, you know, to get into this YouTube game is um, Boston content creation. My naive ass, I had no idea that people were so sensitive. Like these, this is a masculine sport. We, they're supposed to be Mandingo warriors, you know, manly. And bruv, you, if you criticize the fighter, you know, you get called all kinds of names. You might get threatened. I know I can just imagine how much you've been threatened. I've been threatened a, tw- a thousand times. I've only been doing it for six and a half months. So I can just imagine the threats that you've received. But, oh, man, yeah, you're right about that. <laughs> you know, it's, Yo, it's a very sensitive sport, man. But, but it doesn't stop at the fighters. You know, the publicists, the managers. It's a very um, messy sport, too. Like, I remember people coming up to me like, ooh, I heard you pick so-and-so. Wait till Danny find out. Or I know you picking Thurman. Wait till Danny find out. Or, ooh, you going with Thurman. Wait till Porter find out. And this is like people in the industry. And it's like, damn, you can't make a fucking pick. You can't make a pick. At, at the highest level, you better off not picking because you won't get one of them interviews that you picked against. I'm just letting you know. Or... Like Fury did to Radio Raheem, right? Like that was vi- like Radio takes everything on the chin. You know what I mean? He look at it like, fuck it, play me out. I'm still getting paid off these numbers. But Fury played him all because he picked Wilder or he did an interview with Wilder. Remember, that was like the first fight. He like, nah, get out my locker room and all this craziness. Like, why are we subject to that? Because we made a pick. Are you going, are you going to kick Stephen A. Smith out? Is you going to shit on Skip Bellis or Shannon Sharp for, for, for making a pick? No, you're not. No, you're not, but they do that to us. And, you know, look, what, what, what could we do but keep grinding and hope that our platform gets big enough? Like, I, I, my, my my dream, my prayer is to be the Howard Stern of boxing. And then they got to sit down. You you have to sit down. And that's that's what I want, you know, where where I'm Charlie Mane the God, and you got to sit down. Yeah, you yeah, you want this publicity, come sit down then. And we got to ask you them questions. See, I love Floyd for sitting down with, with, with Brian Kenny. When we gonna get that from some of this generation's fighters? You know, someone who's giving it to you right then and there and you giving it back just as good as you getting. We don't get that. These dudes is coddled. They gonna rip the mic off like, yo, what's up with this dude? Like, he ain't supposed to ask me that. And it's like, really? <laughs> All right, thanks, Ness, thanks.